from the eternally gray winter of St. Petersburg. A story about Adel Nagel and leafing through a book with his works. Was a German painter, graphic designer and longtime head of the Berlin Academy of Arts who was one of the most prolific artists of East Germany, born at Berlin Wedding. Nagel was the son of a carpenter and social democrat. After completing his basic schooling, he briefly entered into an apprenticeship with a stained glass painter, but soon broke this off. In 1912 he joined the Social Democratic Party. He was a conscientious objector during the First World War, and was in prison for refusing to serve. After the war he first began to paint, after being exposed to the work of August Mack, he gradually became a staunch communist, joining the Communist Party of Germany in 1920. Throughout the 1920s he was very active in the Berlin art scene, becoming acquainted with Kandy Kowitz, El Lisitsky, and many other notables. He became secretary of the Workers' International Relief, and in 1922 he co-founded the Artists' Relief Division thereof with Erwin Piskater. In 1924, Nagel joined the Red Group in Berlin and accompanied an exhibition of young artists to the Soviet Union. He was close friends with Heinrich Zill and Kandy Kalwitz, whose estate he later handled. Through Nagel, numerous writings about her work have been published. In 1925 he married the Russian singer-actress Valentina Wally Nikitina, one from 1928 to 1931. He joined the November Group and was a co-founder of the Association of Revolutionary Visual Artists from 1928 to 1932. He was publisher and editor-in-chief of the satirical magazine Oil and Spiegel. In 1933, Nagel was elected chairman of the National Association of Visual Artists of Germany. But the election was annulled by the Nazis the next day, when the Nazis seized power. Much of Nagel's work was declared degenerate. He was forbidden to paint, and from 1936 to 1937 he was incarcerated in various Nazi concentration camps, including Sachsenhausen. After the end of the Second World War, Nagel lived and worked in Bergholz Rebrick in Potsdam, Brandenburg, later part of East Germany. In 1945, he was one of the co-founders of the Cultural Association of the GDR. In 1952, he moved to berlin Biesdorf. From 1956 to 1962, he was the president of the DDR Academy of Arts Berlin. He died at berlin Biesdorf in 1967 and was honored with an Ehrengrab in Berlin's Friedrichsfeld Cemetery in 1970. He was posthumously made an honorary citizen of Berlin. Thanks for watching and subscribe to my channel.